Hey guys, Lauren Oliver here. I hope you guys are staying warm. It's freezing in New York. So we're gonna warm up with some questions. The first question comes from Kate Blue 121 from YouTube, who asked if you had to pick three peculiar words or creative words to describe your writing process, what would they be? Mm, well, the first one would definitely be obsessive because I write every day obsessively. The second one would probably be inefficient because I tend to write a lot more than I should write and I tend to trim after after writing a bunch of stuff or um, just kind of pour it all out there and then wrangle it into some shape. The third uh, word, creative word to describe my writing process would be a little bit impressionistic. Um, I just like write snatches of stuff. This is true. This is becoming increasingly true. I used to be a much more regimented writer but now I tend to write a bunch of stuff that I'm not sure exactly where it goes in the novel um, and then try to work it and braid it together as I go forward. Um, I guess I should be working on my writing process because those are not necessarily three good things. Um, at Lena Alomar from Twitter asked which book of the Delirium trilogy is my favorite. Well, I love them all for very different reasons. Um, I really love uh, Delirium because I think it's kind of like one of the more meditative books um, in the series. I think that it um, it really tells the story of Lena and her personal transformation. I love Pandemonium because of the then and now structure and the way that the two um, visions of Lena's life kind of piggyback off each other, bounce bounce off each other. And then I love um, Requiem because I love hearing Hannah's story and I love that the way that Hannah and Lena's stories end up intertwi interweaving so um, and intersecting. So I love them all for different reasons and I hope you do too. Maya Farina from YouTube asks, how do you decide who to dedicate your book to? I really try to think about who's inspired the book or who's been the most helpful force um, when I was writing the book. When I wrote The Spindlers, which is about a sister and a brother, I really knew that I'd pulled a, drawn a lot from both my sister, my relationship to my sister, and my relationship to my best friend Patrick, um, who also lent his name to one of the major characters. So that was kind of obvious. And Panic is dedicated to my editor because she was so supportive while I was writing the book and it was a really hard book for me to write. I try to think about, you know, who's been the kind of guiding force, the, the greatest guiding hand when I've been writing. And Cindy Dale Cruz from YouTube wrote, who are some of your favorite authors at the moment? Um, well, this will be my shameless, shameless shilling for my 92nd Street Y event, but I have to say, one of my favorite authors at the moment is the fabulous Lev Grossman, author of the Magicians Trilogy. Um, he's an amazing, amazing author, and uh, I was a fan of his long before I met him. Um, his third book in the Magicians Trilogy comes out in August, and I'm super excited. But right now, I'm loving him because he agreed to help me um, he agreed to be part of my launch event for Panic at the 92nd Street Y on March 2nd. It's going to be an awesome event. He's completely brilliant. Um, I will try not to say anything dumb. And you guys should all be there. It's a ticket event, so make sure to check out my Tumblr. I've posted a link, get your tickets soon, so you can celebrate the release of Panic, get it a few days early even, and, um, and hear Lev and me talk about writing and Hollywood ad adaptations and uh, and series versus standalones and a lot of other fun writerly stuff. So um, I hope to see you guys there. And in the meantime, send me your questions and I will see you next time on Ask Lauren Oliver.